everyone, I'm here to talk to you about the MAP test. MAP test? I thought we were going to talk about the iReady reading inventory. Close, but no. The MAP test is a new standardized testing platform that students will be using at your school that covers English and math. Oh, I get it. So it's another one of those boring standardized tests. I always, I always sleep through those. So we're actually switching to the MAP because it gives you much more in-depth information about your score. Information that is actually helpful for you, your teachers, and your parents to know. Penny, tell us about scoring. Hey, so this is how it's going to work. You're going to take a test based on your current English or math class. This is the screen you'll see when you're finished with the math test. You'll see your RIT score, your target RIT score, and a breakdown of how you did on each section. Here are the average target ranges for each math level. And here are the average target ranges for each grade level for English. After the English section, you'll see all your typical RIT score information, but you'll also get your Lexile range. Middle schoolers, you don't have to worry about this part. Aisha, are you okay? I hate standardized tests. I always do so bad. Don't stress. This isn't for a grade. The only purpose of this is to see where you are academically and what areas you need to work on. Plus, you might see material that you're not familiar with, but that's okay. Wait, so I should try my best? For my own benefit? Well, you should always be doing that, but yes. Make sure you get a good night's sleep and be ready to do your best. You, your parents, and guardians are the only ones with access to this score, so you shouldn't feel pressured to share it with anyone else.